Well, for the first time since an arrest in the case, a close friend of Dr. Devon Hoover is speaking out. And that comes amid so many questions into why it took more than a year to charge the key suspect. Let's get out live to Sean Leahy. He is joining us with the latest from Detroit's Boston Edison District. Sean, what is she saying about this? I thought of this close friend of Dr. Hoover, wanted to hear what she had to say, tracked her down, and she is talking to me tonight. Let's get right to it, guys. Dr. Hoover's body found here in his beautiful mansion upstairs in a third floor attic. That was April 23rd of last year. Now, a key suspect in the case is named Desmond Burks. You heard about him last week when he was charged with murder on August 8th of this year. So charges coming more than a year after the homicide. A woman who I tracked down to talk today uh, saw both the doctor and Burks inside this home. She wants to know what took so long to charge who she believes was the key suspect all along. So the friend we're talking about here is Megan Beamer. I'm hearing from her tonight, a close friend of Dr. Devon Hoover and being with Hoover at his home. She says the circle of friends saw and knew Desmond Burks. He was here also. And she says from the very start of this investigation, she and others say they alerted DPD that Burks was the likely killer. Burks was arrested, then let go five days after the homicide a year later. More than a year later, Burks is charged. Well, a year later, Burks is charged with killing a 67 year old man during a road rage incident. That's a new case she's reacting to tonight. Did you know his name? Back then? Uh, oh, you know, I don't know. I know does. I know who does is. I know what does does. Why was this man picked up? Because if you pick him up, you got enough to charge him with is what I think. Why was he not kept in jail? Then another family wouldn't have lost their family member like we lost Devon. We've been asking that question. DPD getting back to us saying that this was a complex, lengthy investigation. More will come out when Burks goes to trial. Guys, just scratching the surface here coming up at six. What Beamer, who you just saw there, talks about how often the suspect Desmond Burks was here and why people pointed the finger at him almost immediately. Back to you. All right, Sean. Thanks so much. We'll check back with you at six. Sure thing.